Coco, don't chew the box. Black lid, don't chew the box. Please behave. Would you like to play with this? What's that? I have to take out the plastic. bunnies at lunch subscription box for the month of september it came here pretty much on time for once so i'm happy about that i had to of course sanitize the box and wear gloves because i'll be touching the contents inside well now i could not show you the contents of the august box but it was pretty exciting and they got very nice toys and in fact i kept two toys for later on I didn't open two of the toys out of the six in the August box because they had got plenty of toys instead of treats in the August box. So I kept two aside and gave it to them in the middle of the month because as you know bunnies go through toys and treats very very fast. Uh, to get on to the box contents. We have uh, the picture postcard. I've got a similar one like this uh, before, probably in my first subscription box. And it shows the, the bunnies and a rainbow. And um, I don't particularly like this postcard because um, of certain reasons. It shows the rainbow bridge probably from one cow to another, but I should not overthink it. Let's get into the contents. Okay, now the first thing that we have is simply nibbles and this is from it's a tropical fruit cushions uh, it shows pineapple and uh, some other kind of fruit and uh, i i'm not very sure that they're going to accept it because not all bunnies are very uh, you know ex uh, they don't accept uh, new things in a very uh, in a very easy way and uh, it does have a picture of a bunny and a guinea pig and a hamster and we shall see what the uh, contents are so these are ideal for rabbits gerbils guinea pigs mice hamsters and rats and uh, oh the other day it was very interesting i saw two squirrels in the pet store and i asked him uh, and they was and they were looking so sad to be inside that glass cage and when they should be free and when I came home I realized that I should have just got them I should have paid for them and got them and then left them onto some tree in my compound because there are so many trees but I didn't do that and the distances are very big here in Saudi Arabia and that is something which I have regrets for but anyway, I hope that the squirrels have found a nice home wherever they've gone. Because when I went to the pet store again, I didn't see them. So, I mean, like who would want to keep squirrels as pets anyway? They're supposed to be free on the trees. So, uh, the contents of this are cereals, derivatives of vegetables origin, including timothy, hay, fruits, banana apricot pineapple and passion fruit vegetable protein extract vitamin e a d e good that it does oh and it has vitamin c as well i don't really like any uh, product which has vitamin c because rabbits don't actually need vitamin c i'll just see i'll just uh, find out if my rabbits want to accept this but most probably not because they don't like pineapple anyway uh, so now let's get on to the next item now the next item is rosewood naturals apple and uh, apple orchid okay uh, now th what i was surprised about rosewood is it being such a famous company for making rabbit treats i ordered a dandelion product recently and uh, dandelion sticks I don't know if any of you are using it but the dandelion stick in the composition it was written egg and egg products now when have rabbits started becoming 
are carnivores. I've always, I mean, everybody knows that rabbits are herbivores, not carnivores. And I don't think rabbits can have egg and egg products. So, Rosewood Natural, what is up with you guys? I mean, I think I should write a letter to them. I've done it in the past with Vita Craft, which is a giant German company. And I had bought some treats which had very high contents of vitamin C. So I wrote to them and they gave me a big explanation of how rabbits can have vitamin C as well. But I did a lot of research and I came and I found out that rabbits cannot do not need vitamin C. Not like guinea pigs. Guinea pigs need extra vitamin C but not rabbits. So Rosewood Naturals, if any of you are uh, really into these products, I suggest that you always read the contents because sometimes they can be misleading and I mean like I, which rabbit is gonna have eggs and egg products very soon they'll be sitting at our table having breakfast with us is that what is gonna happen soon so let's see the contents of this now uh, you know how you would rather eat tasty food carefully prepared with healthier more interesting ingredients well so would your small pet and now they can Okay, and the composition is apple wood, apple slices, blackberry leaves and stems and all as dried ingredients. So not too bad. I mean everything is uh, edible by a little uh, bunny and it's safe. Now this mix may contain blackberry stems with thorns. You may choose to carefully remove these but most rabbits and rodents will safely choose to eat these. Okay. They always give a warning like that. I appreciate that. But again, Rosewood, why egg and egg products in your uh, treats for little bunnies? Okay, let's go on to the third product now. Now, this looks a little interesting. Uh, it looks like a little um, a mat, edible mat with hay in it. And uh, let's see what it actually is. Uh, it's a oh it's a, <laughs> pineapple tacos handmade toy for bunnies natural uh, hessian french best quality of hay dried organic pineapple again pineapple I'm not a very good advocate for pineapple especially now that coco's um, tummy has really improved with the oxbo digestive supplements the digestive biscuits i mean Guys, if your bunny is having problems with the digestive tract or poop, the poop is not forming or the poop is too small, please, please try the Digestive Oxbow Natural Science tablets. They are so good. They are so good. Really, Coco's appetite has really come up. She's drinking water now. It's really amazing. So, I will think about giving them this toy to play with. Maybe Clockwork can have a go. Add it and if and in Coco anyway is very choosy so if she doesn't like it she's not gonna go for it so I trust her with this but I'm 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 really little disappointed that there are so many things with pineapple this month now this looks very interesting it's a very oh it's a nice like kind of a gunny bag kind of pouch a jute bag pouch maybe a treat surprise treat um it's a veg bath sakaru again by rosewood very interesting because i don't see all these things online maybe you do get it we don't get it here in saudi arabia even if we order on our amazon there are very very few limited products so in this one we have hang our natural jute bag in your pet's home and watch the fun begin as they try to get the lush meadow hay and eight different herbs and veggies if they destroy the bag they'll have a lot of fun if not, just refill with one of our many salad, salads, ideal for all small animals. Right? And uh, of course, we have to check the contents. That uh, the contents are meadow hay. Uh, I'm not. I don't really know. I don't. Uh, Rosewood has sent a cube with meadow hay, and Clockett really liked it. And uh, I really want to try orchid grass. And so this has parsnip, parsley, pumpkin, chicory, dandelion, peppermint, beetroot, red pepper and it was and it's a complimentary pet food and it's a pet thing that all is fine. Ah and I want to tell you 
that before buying the dandelion uh, delight sticks from rosewood this exact same company think a hundred times because i remember i just gave clocklet two small pieces and he was really hungry and he ate them and then he actually could not move after that he got rather sick so my husband and i we had to move him around and give him we take him out to the garden to eat fresh grass to get whatever he ate out of his system and then he became fine so i kept it really far away from them and i'm not going to give it to them at all even though i spent quite a lot of money on it okay so now the next product is and, and that did not come with the bunnies uh, that lunch subscription box but i'm just warning you against that so now again we have the rosewood bottom breaker lufa hula this is pretty cute it goes well with the rabbits and uh, and the colors are also uh, it, it's made with safe materials dyes and glues and uh, the rabbits are they pretty much like this i think i'll save this for the middle of the month because it's going to be destroyed in no time so i'll keep it and this is the last and the sixth item this is the uh rosewood natural summer harvest this is most welcome in my house because it i use it as a rose i mean a hay topper and it has all a mix of herbs fruits vegetables and edible flowers and uh, these are these products are really good because if you give it to your bunny they are super happy they going to eat up their hay in like um, no time i had ordered a small pack of this uh and it's almost finished and it has really good things uh it has uh, pea flakes raspberry leaves uh, mallow herb uh, chamomile herb rose blossom marigold blossom cornflower uh, then strawberry sunflower petals mallow blossoms and all dried ingredients now when i ordered the smaller pack it had burst corn in it and i had to literally pick out the burst corn pieces because again i googled and i saw that bunnies should not be having corn in any form now i don't know i mean are things changing so much that that they're giving burst corn to rabbits i just took it out from there so you have to constantly keep an eye on what you're buying just don't be fooled don't be blinded by whatever is being sold on the net and even these huge big companies i don't know why they're they're selling things which rabbits are not supposed to have and like some people they just might not know you know and it's difficult so anyway so let's uh, do a, let's do a conclusion of what we got in the box and i think i really like the august box better uh, cuz i got a whole load of toys there were so many toys and there were, like out of six items i think four were toys and two were just snacks and here again we have more snacks and less toys and i really i really need the toys of course i do need the snacks but um the toys are preferred too so we have this naturals then we have naturals veg pat sakaru we have this pineapple uh, tacos very interesting and we have the apple orchard and we orchard and we have this toy here the lufa toy very nice and interesting and we have the simply nibbles which i'm going to think like three times for giving them and i don't they're not going to like it anyway i know them and then of course the postcard and so that it that is it that is the subscription box for september uh, very beautifully packed very nice and um, it's pretty good i should not be so skeptical uh, let's give them a chance and um, it's really good it's it looks good and at least there's variety and even if your rabbit doesn't have all six of the products i'm definite that he or she is going to have five out of the six so it was really good and uh, hope you enjoyed the uh, video and see you next time bye have a wonderful day